as I speak now, uh, there are people that have been abducted in our area of jurisdiction, that is none other than Kawempe North. Uh, men in plain clothes, having guns, they have just abducted uh, a one Mutiaba areas and a brother uh, whom I'm yet to identify. Subscribe just in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melaz Milo aka Fuller. Follow me on TikTok. I'm using the same names right there. And uh, you can also get in touch with Haj Mukisa Karim Omsomi Wedua and he will get you sorted right there. Well, yesterday there was another shooting in Fort Porto at a UPDF barracks. An officer identified as Corporal Avugo shot dead his two colleagues and another sustained serious injuries and was rushed to hospital for treatment. The suspect is currently on the run, but uh, the deputy spokesperson of uh, UPDF, uh, Deo Akiki, said efforts to have him arrested are underway. This year, gun violence has been on another level right here in Uganda. And uh, we don't know how the year is going to end because uh, we still have like five months ahead to end the year. But what do you make of the gun violence right here in Uganda this year? I feel like we have registered a lot of shootings in this year compared to other years. Insecurity too much in the country. But the comment section is very open for you. What do you think about gun violence in this year right here in Uganda? Greetings, uh, friends, on the Buzz UG. My name is Alex Luswaluemba, PA to Honorable Segirinya, uh, commonly known as Mr. Kawempe on Facebook and all other social media platforms. Uh, gun violence uh, in Uganda uh, this year, it has never changed. It Actually, it's growing. Why am I saying that? We've had many incidents that are happening even as I speak now. Uh, there are people that have been abducted in our area of jurisdiction. That is none other than Kawempe North. Uh, men in plain clothes, um, having guns. They have just abducted uh, a one Mutiaba areas and a brother. Uh, whom I'm yet to identify. So you can see that, you know, that gun violence. Uh, in Uganda, it's where you find uh, a civilian who has never attended any military course, any uh, military training, owning a gun. So the incidence of gun violence, actually, it's raising day by day. And since we don't have rule of law in our country because if we had a uh, rule of law uh, uh, this gun violence maybe we, we could have ended it actually this started in um early 2021 uh, when Robert Chagrin center came out to contest for uh, the presidency it is evident enough that uh, many ugandans were abducted and since now they are still being abducted uh, using the guns we must be very, very, very vigilant. And actually, in our area of jurisdiction, Kawempe North, we are trying to reach out to our people, sensitizing them on how to defend themselves. Actually, the gun violence normally happens in areas where the supporters of NUP gather, more especially areas of Waise, areas of uh, Mpererwe. So I don't know what is their biggest fear and... Uh, what is their cause uh, to have our people being abducted, our people being tortured. So we are trying out to reach to them and buying some uh, whistles in case someone is being abducted. So they use those whistles to actually alert our people that actually danger is in, uh, dangers are happening in the areas. We are not safe at all. Thank you, the Buzz UG. Thank you. Kind people subscribe to the Buzz UG. Uh, love you, manager.